Don't be a secret agent. That might sound interesting, but what I'm about to tell you, most people don't do and they really don't wanna do. The first part of not being a secret agent is letting people know that you're in real estate and it comes to your car. I started with car sign magnets on the side of my car. Um, it, it, that's evolved to, to decals on the back of windows, license plate frames, and now people have their cars wrapped entirely. I can't tell you how many times this has come up for me in coaching and training real estate agents. They're afraid it's tacky. They're afraid it's gaudy. They're afraid, oh my gosh, I'm not gonna do that to my car. Oh my gosh. The amount of conversations they have from their car alone, I've seen they could buy a separate car just from those conversations. Every time they're driving into their neighborhood where they live, people think, oh my gosh, hey, there's Brian going again. He's, he's working a lot. Wow, he's working odd hours. I'm not working. I'm just driving my car. But they don't know that, and that's what's important. And people will approach you at times with this. And if you're doing other marketing, or let's just say you're doing an open house, they know where you are. They know who you are. They know, hey, you're setting up the signs. That must be Brian over there. Hey, I want to go talk to him. Other things about not being a secret agent, which some people can be uncomfortable with, is wearing your name tag. Now that's like, oh my gosh, I never want to wear a name tag. But I can't tell you how many times just having wearing a name tag, somebody said, so how's, how's real estate doing right now? That's a lead. They just offered to engage you in a real estate conversation, which you never would have had, had you not worn your name tag. So even if you're at the grocery store, if you're at church, if you're what are just running errands, having that name tag on, it's amazing how many conversations come up with that, that you can engage in. But some of this stuff can be uncomfortable for a lot of people. Through the years, that's brought up so many times. And how much money you can make from doing these types of things would solve the, any concerns most people have with doing this. And are we really proud with what we do? If we're not, then, then get out of real estate for crying out loud. Don't do this. That's what this is. Embrace it. I can't tell you how many times I hear this. Brian, I see you everywhere. And I'm thinking to myself, you see me everywhere? I haven't even been in this store. They've seen my car. They've seen my signs. They've seen other marketing materials out there with my face on it. So it's just a part of marketing that they will see me in at least three different spots consistently every single month. Why not make your car one of them? And every time they see it, hey, they're thinking of you. And, and don't be afraid to park your car in your driveway. It's a free billboard in your driveway, for crying out loud. It's awesome stuff. If you want the business, you want now business, let people know. It's a real easy decision. Don't be a secret agent.